Good afternoon and welcome to the very first L2 Lead and Learn for Surrey 2014. I'm delighted that you have chosen to be here today and I want to thank each one of you for making the effort to put this in your diary and to be here with us today. Today, you are surrounded by people just like yourself. You are surrounded by other forward-thinking people. People who understand the importance of leadership. People who understand the valuable investment that it takes to invest in themselves for personal growth and for leadership. Leaders are learners. And today, this event is a testimony to that fact. I often say to leaders, never take off your L plates. Keep learning, keep being teachable, because that's the way we grow. And as we invest in ourselves, our leadership qualities and abilities, they continue to grow. And ultimately, we become more effective with those that we lead. Today, I also want to give a very warm welcome to His Worship the Mayor and Mayoress of Woking, who have come to celebrate with us today. My name is Tony Lynch and I'm your host today for this magnificent event. I can say to you very confidently, as a qualified leadership coach, trainer and speaker for John Maxwell, that today we are in for a treat. John Maxwell is known for his delivery, for his content, for his inspiration and for the framework that he delivers as he teaches about leadership and personal growth. John, in fact, has now written over 75 books on leadership and personal growth. He's, he's also sold over 23 million books that have now been translated into 50 different languages. He's a busy man. And I tell you, I am honored to be working with him and to be in association with him and to be part of the John Maxwell team. Today, you will hear from John as he speaks and as he shares. He will speak about good leaders ask great questions. We will be impacted by that. You will also hear today from Linda Kaplan Taylor and Tim Sanders. They are gurus when it comes to marketing and building a brand and we will learn a lot from them. I know that uh, John, Tim and Linda are very excited about this event today. In this room, we are sitting amongst many business leaders who lead companies of various sizes. We have entrepreneurs here. We have team leaders. We have church leaders. We have managers. We have employees. We have many different people here today. I'm sure you would agree with me today that we are in good company. I want you to, just for a moment, turn to the person next to you and say, I'm really pleased that you are here today. I tell you, there's quite a buzz in this room today, which I'm really pleased about. It's great to see so many of you here. As I looked at the list that grew from the first person who registered to the very last person who registered for this event, there were two things that struck me. The first one was that these people who are registering are committed to adding value to other people. They want to make a difference in other people's lives. 
The second thing that struck me was the distance that some people have come to be with us today. Today we have people in this room from Doncaster, London, Surrey, Hampshire and Somerset. It's amazing. Why don't you give yourselves a round of applause for that? <laughs> this event has attracted uh, a high level of interest. What is L2 about? A lot of people have been asking and it's captured good attention and a lot of people are talking about this and therefore I am very confident about this event today. So much so that I can say to you that on October the, te on October the 9th, 2015, I will be hosting the next L2. However, I expect that event to be on a much bigger scale as I work with other business leaders. I want to thank a few people in this room who have encouraged me over the last few months, set up different meetings, use social media, encourage people to be at this event. So I'm just going to mention a few names. I just ask you to keep standing until I come to the end of the list. Paul Webster. <laughs> Louise Punter. <laughs> Andy Wilmot. Matt Peachy and Adrian Keeling. <coughs> these people, just keep standing for a moment, these people are represent the Woking Chamber of Commerce, the Surrey Chamber of Commerce, Woking Borough Council, the best of Woking. I want to thank you for your support. I want to thank you for your encouragement for today. But also, I want to thank you as well for your commitment to excellence. Keep going for it. You're making a difference in many people's lives. Thank you. <laughs> My team and I are here today to serve you the best we can. If you have any questions, please do come and ask. Some of my team will be at the back of the hall later and they will be ready to sell you various books that you may want to take away later with you. But for now, I would like to welcome to the front His Worship, the Mayor of Woking, to come and address us. Why don't we give him a huge round of applause. <laughs> 